Hello guys, this is day two that I am using the Cayenne Pepper Tonic on my hair. As you can see, I got all over my hairline again. And uh, I'm going to show you in this video um, how I've made a large batch of this. So this is what it looks like. Okay. I took coconut oil and I filled it all the way up. And then I put about almost a whole jar of cayenne pepper. As you can see, the cayenne pepper fell to the bottom. And uh, I'm just going to let this sit for a few days. Um, today I took a whole tablespoon of this and I saturated my whole head with it. Um, after a few minutes, it'll start tingling. It'll start burning because it's increasing the circulation on the scalp. And... Uh, the really nice thing about using this is that it's really affordable and it's really cheap to make. Now there's also a really good product if you don't want to make your own. Um, I would recommend this Scalp Tonic. It's from Tonya Zavasta who is a raw food author and she's got some raw food products. Um, they sell this on Natural News. You can get it at her website. It's just a really good um, a real, another really good scalp tonic to try out. It's got mustard greens in here, cayenne pepper, apple stem extract. A lot of these ingredients have been proven to help s stimulate hair follicles and encourage regrowth. Um, it is a little on the pricey side, so that's why I'm making my own. Again, and that's really easy to do. Just get it like a big mason jar, get some extra virgin olive oil or some coconut oil, whatever you want, or jojoba oil. You can even use castor oil. Doesn't really matter. Um, just don't use like mineral oil or baby oil. You want to use, you know, good, a good uh, organic oil. And then just uh, put the kind pepper in there, you know, and it'll infuse. The oil will turn red, you know, and then use that as your tonic for your hair. And uh, the most important thing with using something like this is consistency. Okay. If you if you're doing it, you know here and there, um, I don't believe that it's going to be as beneficial as if someone did it every day. So I recommend you know to do this every single day. Um, probably in the morning's best time to do it. You know when you first get up, put it on your hair, and then just you know let it sit on there for 30 to an hour, 30 minutes to an hour, and then shampoo it out. Now. I would use, I'm going to make another video of the shampoo that I use. And uh, prior to using the scalp tonic though, before I go to bed, I will saturate my whole head with coconut oil or olive oil. You know, you can alternate every night. And uh, olive oil has been shown to inhibit DHT. And also coconut oil has been shown to inhibit 5-alpha reductase because of lauric acid in the coconut oil. So both of those oils are extremely beneficial applying them to your head. And so, you know, just saturate your whole head and scalp with those oils every night before you go to bed. Then when you wake up, then apply the scalp tonic. Leave it on for 30 minutes to an hour or longer if you like. And then afterwards, I use Avalon Organics Biotin Thickening Shampoo with Salt Palmetto. And that's what I use just to shampoo my hair. I don't use a conditioner because, of course, I'm getting my hair conditioned every night with the oil. So, and it made a huge, huge improvement in my hair. I mean, if you start doing that every night, and you're eating a healthy diet, and you're taking Heath Shu Wu, you know, and some of these um, hair supplements and vitamins that are really good for your hair, you're going to notice huge beneficial effects for your, in your hair. Um, so, you're, it's definitely the best game plan that I have and know of currently. Um, that works really, really well. So, you know, cayenne pepper really does increase your circulation. It's one of the best herbs for that. It's also great to take internally. There's a lot of beneficial effects taking it in internally. It can encourage hair growth. Um, it also helps make all the other herbs that you take more potent. Um, so if you're taking Hishu Wu and you take kind together, it just helps 
Tisha Wu to work better if you're taking cayenne with your other herbs and vitamins. So, this is how I make a big batch of this stuff, and it'll save you a lot of money. Cayenne's not that expensive. Olive oil is available everywhere, so it's coconut oil. So, you know, why not do this and save yourself a fortune of money instead of using something like Rogaine? Because Rogaine has minoxidil, which is a drug. It can cause irritation to your eyes. It can cause irritation on your skin. It can cause other complications in your body. Because remember, whatever you put on your, your body or your skin or your hair absorbs into your body. So your liver has to detoxify all these things. And so if you're putting all these chemicals on, you're just burdening your body, you know, which is not necessary, you know, and it's not just, it's just not a good thing to do. And uh, Rogaine costs a lot of money, and the thing is, is even when you stop using it, the hair will just fall out again because you're not addressing the root cause of the problem, why you lost the hair in the first place. And again, the reason we lose our hair in the first place is because of DHT. So you got to attack this problem internally and externally. And so that's why I recommend everybody get on a supercritical CO2 extract of sal palmetto. Guy Herbs has a really good um, sal palmetto extract. Highly recommend that one. And, you know, doing these things externally and using a shampoo with sal palmetto. And if you do those things and you're, you're attacking the issue internally and externally, you're going to really help prevent this problem in some cases, you can even regrow your hair. So, you know, the choice is yours. You gotta decide, you know, are you gonna go the chemical route or are you gonna go the natural route? If you go the chemical route, it's just gonna cost you more money, there's gonna be more side effects, and your hair still might fall out. So what's, what, you know, it's not worth anything. But if you go the natural route, you can still prevent the problem. You still have a chance of regrowing your hair. And even if you do lose your hair, you're still benefiting your body with all these good, healthy, natural whole things. They have other benefits. So it's like a win-win situation when you go the natural route. And, of course, it's a lot cheaper, too. So, uh, this is day two of using the cayenne pepper, and um, I'll keep you guys up to date. If you like this video, please favorite, like, subscribe. Thanks.